from here, I'm going to hold my bow still. Remember all those empty hand cottage where I said that you don't move your hands until you finish your step? Mm-hmm. This is why. Getting ahead, trying to teach you good fundamentals. You're going to take this bow and you're going to push that opponent forward. It's going to stay straight ahead of you. You're not going to let it do this. not going to let it do that. not going to let it fall. Push him straight into that opponent. Once you pop him with that first strike here, now when we go forward, we're pushing against him. Pushing him back. So that now when we get here, this hand is going to pull straight back. Now let me make this point. When you pull this hand back, don't do this. That's not good. You're going to drop the elbow down here. Okay, so the elbow falls in and pull. And at the same time, that hand goes forward, you're striking. All right. So let me watch everybody do this. We're doing good. I hope you all are following along with me because if you are, you're sweating like me. Hang on a minute. My goodness. Kalani, you got to quit going in and out. All right, very good position, Trent. Very good position, Greg. All right, now, go to your first position, feet together. That's right, and your hand up by your chest. Excellent, that's good, really good, guys. All right, now, go ahead and step with your right foot. Oh, go ahead, that's fine. One, now step with the right foot into a front stance. And pull that left elbow back and strike. Go ahead and strike. Yes, very good. Excellent, excellent, Greg and Trent. That's good. Caleb, let me see it. Well, you're almost a brown belt. You better have this. Nice, Sadie. Caleb, you got to move. I can't see sister. Do it again, Sadie. There you go, baby. Do it again. Now listen. Go back. Go. Stop. Now, ah, 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 don't go yet. When you do this strike, make sure your elbow comes down, straight down towards your belly. Go slow. Let me see it. No, your elbow, baby, your elbow's still coming out like this. You're still doing this with your elbow like that, okay? You're doing this. Up it down this way when you pull back on that strike, okay? All right, let me see who else we got. Okay, let's go over here. Uh, I'd have lost John Gunner. All right, Kalani, do it one time, go. Kalani, go. Go. I ain't got time, okay. All right, there's John Gunner. All right, John Gunner, do you have a bow that you can work with? Okay, that's fine. We'll get you one, all right? Uh, there's actually one at the gym up there in Troy, but the gym's locked, as we all know. All right, excellent, guys. That is pretty good. All right, so that everybody knows this, in addition to doing the Zoom and to doing the Facebook Live, I am recording it at the same time. So what I'm having to do is I'm having to go back and I'm having to chop up the training videos into small sections before I can post them because it's just too big. And let me post it. <clears throat> but we're good so far. Everybody's looking good. Facebook Live people, just, just assume you look good because we're going to assume that. Okay, so now we are in this position now. We're in our, this is our second count, uh, really our first full step. All right, so if I get here, now let's talk about this real quick. When you're in this position, the same principle applies with the grips. You want to have the palms against the bow. You don't want to be palms loose against the bow like that. That's, that's bad. So good grips here. One thing you want to do with the bow, and we teach you this in empty hand too, this is ski position, right? This is not ski position. And I don't know why people, you put a stick in their hand and they want to start doing this with their ski. Okay, ski is still with the elbows back. So make sure when you're in this position, that elbow's back behind you. Now, one thing that is different about your ski position with the bow, because you got, you're got working both hands together, it's not going to be as far back. You're not going to pull as far back because that's going to pull your strike back. Okay, you want that hand a little forward of your hip. Okay. Also, you want the wrist, inside of the wrist, 
against your hip or your, your belt. Uh, not, not, not the palm of hammer fist area. All right, so here we are.